Hey guys, by now most people have seen Gimmer's video about slingshotting, this new movement option. Everyone has been testing this out with tons of different characters. However, I needed some time to do some more testing with Banjo to see exactly how this would affect him. Interestingly enough, Banjo has a lot to gain from this new tech. It will take some time to really see how well this will improve his game plan and his neutral and his cluster movement options, but time will tell and it really does seem though that the potential is really cool. Before we move forward, I just want to remind you that I stream weekly on this YouTube channel. Make sure to turn on notifications to know when I go live, or you can join the Discord to get those notifications as well. Link in the description below. I also coach on Medify as a banjo specialist and improvement coach. If you would like some one-on-one -on -one quality feedback and some in-depth coaching and training, click on the link in the description below to book an appointment. When Banjo slingshots, he gains a lot more momentum and movement possibilities. Normally, his airspeed is awful and backflipping is his best option. However, now with what I'm calling ring shotting, Banjo has a lot more mix ups and movement options. Ring shotting combined with grenade and egg are really effective for better spacing and bait and punishing. Combining grenade and ring shotting sends Banjo much farther back for retreating and zoning. Ring shotting and egg are great for starting Brico combos or pushing your opponent out. So, let's talk about ring shot combos. Banjo's forward air is negative 6 on his shield, making it really safe. So, combined with this new movement option, Banjo can get more creative combo and kill converts. Here are some examples, and for a lot of them, assume that I have already spaced the border correctly and I'm following up with the slingshot. It's just easier to demonstrate that way than trying to properly program the CPU to react accordingly. If you're liking the video so far, make sure to subscribe, drop a like, and leave a comment down below. I always love reading those comments from you guys, and it means a lot and helps the channel grow. And if you would really like to support the channel, Super Thanks is now available on my channel. Ring shotting allows for Banjo to be even more creative with his ledge trapping and edge guarding. Releasing a grenade from roll distance and then bring shotting backwards sets up for easy ledge trumps instead of a slip off or back. Using ring shotting to gain more momentum off stage sets up for solid edge guards such as back air, forward air, or neutral air. Normally I use backflip to set up for these situations, but ring shotting is faster and gives better distance instead of having to waste jumps or other resources. Banjo's forward air combined with ring shotting can apply a lot of shield pressure, and I just want to demonstrate a couple of those situations here. Banjo can also use Bringshot Grab to get a larger grab range and shift Banjo's hurt box. This is good for punishing shield grabs or other laggier options. This is also good for bait and punishes as well. This last bit of information in this video actually isn't Bringshot related, but I actually found it by accident when I was trying to do all this labbing. But it's actually kind of game changing for Banjo's shield pressure. Forward air is negative 6 on shield when spaced correctly, and I harp on that incessantly. However, what happens when it is not spaced correctly? When Banjo grabs, he shifts his body backwards. Because of this, if forward air is misspaced and your opponent goes for a shield grab, if you immediately press grab, Banjo will lean back and then beat out the enemy's grab. This is game changing and will help Banjo exploit opponents who get too antsy. So there's a lot more that Slingshot can be used for and I guarantee with time it'll really be understood if Banjo can use it more effectively. But these are just some things that I found that I wanted to share as this tech is still very new. Um, but I just want to say thank you for watching as always guys. I hope you can use this tech to push the Banjo meta forward. Make sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe. I will see you guys next time.